All right, I'm finally back. Um, I know I've been gone quite a while, but I thought I'd make a video coming back after I'm a bit more confident. Um, I've been recently catching a few pike, so today I am feeling quite confident. It has been raining for throughout the whole night, so I know wherever I'm gonna go, it's gonna be murky. Um, so I'm either gonna chuck on a spinner bay or a big paddle tail. Now we've had quite a constant week or so of it being about seven degrees eight degrees so i'm i'm quite confident today that they're going to be on the feed if they're not on the feed where i'm hoping they are i'm going to go to a different venue and try that but i'm sorry i haven't posted in about six months um i've just been super busy and getting myself in the right state to start posting again if you would like more constant posts um you should follow my fishing instagram which will be on the screen or in the description um i post pretty much most of my catches or ones that i'm proud of on there so you can always go and give that a follow if you'd like without further ado we'll go and have a few chucks and see if we can get anything nice uh i'm not expecting anything big today i'm expecting jacks about this big so don't think this is going to be a big fish video it's going to be just getting back into the flow of posting and yeah it's with some pike fishing which i know you all like so i'll see you then so we've switched to the peter in this color i will put the name on screen i literally cannot remember but it's my favorite color that they do so super natural should be good for this particular venue Come on, fish. Obviously, as we know, the Peters swim very high. So I would recommend putting on a weight. I love the peters as well because I've even had perch on peters or perch go for them. I've had perch go for the big peter. This is only the little one, this uh, rod. I wouldn't feel confident casting the, casting the heavier one on. But especially with this rod because it is you know, nearly eight foot, or it is eight foot. No, nearly eight foot. You can proper cast out layers a long, a long way. So be good for if you fish it on a reservoir or big lake. It's not um, a cold day, it's about 10 degrees today, so they should, you know, not be laid up really. They should be feeding okay. We've had a good bit of weather the last few days in terms of like it being about this same temperature. So, I'm hoping we can get a couple. Yeah, there we go. Just as I'm saying that, I hope we can get a couple bites. Got one. Only little. Nothing huge. Here he is, look. Right, I don't think he's hooked very well. Jack, nothing big. This is him, just a little one, not very big. A few pound, nothing, nothing crazy. See, he was caught. 
beauty. Also the hat I'm wearing is from Forecast Clothing. If you want to go check them out, I'll put the link in the description. But yeah, nice fish to get to start the day. Hopefully get a couple more. Maybe a bit bigger, fingers crossed. All right, let's get him off. Off he goes. All right, so put on the Savage Gear four plate V2135. That's what it says on the top. But um, yeah, I had a nice nine pounder on this not long ago, so hoping I can get something nice on it. Not just weed. We'll see. It's something a bit flashier for them. Not as dull. So yeah, we'll see. Hopefully, we can get them to have a little munch on it. I don't know what happened there. Yeah, there we go. There we go. On a bad cast. I tell you this, I always get fish on bad casts. I don't know what it is. They just must... They must just know. You've done a bad cast, we'll reward you with a fish. Very shape. He's only little again. Only a little guy. A mm, couple pound maybe. I think he's gonna try and swim. Let's get him in. There we go. Grill. He's probably mm, about. Four pound? Four, well, beautiful fish. Uh, he has been in a little bit of a fight on his fin, if you can see. He's basically hurt there and this fin is torn up. But, beautiful fish. I'm gonna get him back, he's behaving well, but I'm gonna get him back and uh, yeah, release him. Off he goes. There we go. Right, let's keep going. I might try that roach if that's okay. Yeah, It's barely hooked. It's big. Oh, it looks bigger. Grab him. That's a double in it. First of the session. Oh my god. She's beautiful. Oh, 
think that'll end off this video. How, how heavy is she? 12.6. She's 12.6. I'm sorry about the wind. Okay, so again, this has been filmed after the video was made. As you can see, we caught a really nice pike in it. I think it weighed about 12 and a half pound. And that's one of the biggest I've, I think it's the second biggest I've had out of that canal, which is great. Um, if you did like the video, you can go ahead and give it a thumbs up and um, leave a comment and subscribe if you'd want. But I'm sorry I've been gone a while. Hopefully we'll get back into the flow of making videos. Hopefully the venues near me will clear up and I can fish other places too. But it seems like there's a lot of low doubles in that in that venue especially. So I probably will fish there again. But yeah, hopefully you enjoyed the video. I will see you in the next one.